The ungodly lag, so perfect you don't even know how good you are. And when you mix that in with off your seat, sweating forehead contests, constant disconnects, okay. and straight jump scare gangbangs, it's just simply perfection. I welcome you to the perfectly unstable situation of Lords of the Fallen PvP. So captivating, even grandma couldn't wait to get her hands on it. <sighs> she was a good lady. Look, I think we can all agree on the fact that PvP is an absolute hot mess right now. When you go to invade somebody, you're looking at like a one to two second delay, if you're lucky. Majority of the time when I invaded somebody, I was literally standing across the room and they were able to hit me. <laughs> I mean, it was extremely laughable. And with all these latency issues compiled together, you get absolutely slapped by the disconnects. And also stuck in some very interesting <laughs> situations. Rough day at the office, I suppose. <laughs> Guys, come on. This is my only way out of here. <laughs> I actually can't get out of here. Well, that works. I would most definitely deem PvP to be extremely unplayable. Did this stop me from doing it? No. Why? Because I'm an absolute sucker for punishment. Yeah, so it turns out when they go to Umbral, you get a bit of help, which makes, I, it makes no sense. Look, as an invader, I get that you have some disadvantages. You only have two health pots compared to the what you normally have, and also you're only dealing with one life. But if you're able to get them down once and put them into Umbral, the advantage just flips on its head completely. Especially if you're far Surprise, enough in the game to have the Reaper. Because all you need to do is just hang about for a bit and let the boys take care of the rest. Now just imagine that mess with all the rubber banding happening. I quite literally put myself through hell playing PvP, but I found it really fun. Yeah, it was a horrible experience and I really need to stop contradicting myself, but that challenge it put in front of me, I just could not resist. To the point where I started to create my own strategies to try and beat the latency. My first strategy was simply communication by movement. We all know it's a universal sign of I'm friendly. I think it seemed to work. Now it was phase two. This was the hide and seek phase, primarily to show that we're somewhat cute and not dangerous, which then leads on to the simple greet just to solidify our standing. It works every single time, and that's a Santa guarantee. Wait, what the f Now this strategy is family fun for everybody, and it's very simple. All you need to do is seek out your opponent, let them know you mean business, and chase them around. <laughs> You would not believe how many times this actually happened. And if any of the last two strategies didn't work for you, well I have one more. And I like to call it the aggressive handshake. Now the ideal situation for this strategy to roll out correctly is if you invade and you're already in Umbral. This just means that your new best friend is most likely going to be highly distracted. This is going to give you the perfect opportunity to run in and give that aggressive greeting. 9 out of 10 times they're not going to like it but that's okay, we're going to let them just release release their anger. And that's when we strike another greeting once again. At this point in time he's going to start getting a bit confused, but what he doesn't realise is enough time has gone by for your little buddies to spawn in. Which is where you wave your goodbyes and sit back and watch them get killed by a reaper. Now that's a job well done. Now, just remember, try these at your own risk. I don't want to read down in the comments how you somehow ended up in the hospital and it's all my fault. Speaking of hospitals, this bloody menu of the Shrine of Adair really nearly made me send myself there. It's an absolute nightmare to go and buy things from. I had to go in and out multiple times just to purchase multiple items. I thought it looked pretty cool, but looking at it now, maybe I don't. Maybe this wasn't worth my time at all. <laughs> As I said before, I really need to stop contradicting myself. Look, 
I really hope someone fixes this as soon as possible because there is a lot of fun to be had in PvP and I have plenty of more fun filled strategies for you to learn. So if someone from Hexwork is out there watching, do it for the boys. Next time I show you how to make friends.